Good morning YouTubers, Jim here. Just finished the mod on my 2020 Pelican Bass Raider 10E. And I just thought maybe you folks might want to see it. Uh, I put casting decks on the front and the back. A uh, little mercury outboard on it. Riptide trolling motor. It's got uh, running lights, courtesy lights, USB port charge, and a 12 volt charge. Got two places for our rods to be stored where we don't trip over them on the sides. Carpeted deck. Here in Florida, we kind of fish a lot of vegetation, so we don't opt for a foot-controlled trolling motor. We use a hand control with a foot switch. So it just makes it a little bit easier in the weeds, which is where we find most of our fish. Got a little uh, Continental Kayak trailer that I modified to, uh, to accommodate it. see how we modified it a little bit the whole tray or the whole boat uh, it's made no screw holes in the boat I really don't like drilling holes in my boat especially a plastic boat so I arranged this to where we didn't have to screw anything down everything's attached to the bottom deck and uh, the trolling motor bracket so it's pretty well pretty well secured uh, it's got two VMAX uh, 12 volt batteries and a VMAX auto charger onboard charger on it uh, 60 amp trolling motor circuit breaker uh, everything's wired all the way up to the front we've got courtesy lights in all the storage compartments the floor and underneath the front deck and the front storage compartment all have courtesy lights inside so you can see what you're doing at night. Uh, put courtesy lights on it because we do a lot of night fishing here too and uh, these little lakes around here these people they tend to get on their jet skis with no lights on at night so you, you really kind of need to make sure they see you so uh, anyway that's kind of where we're at and uh, just finished this up yesterday so there's the, the battery compartment probably can't see it but that's okay here's my little onboard battery charger the uh, rod holders operate like this with just a little strap so we didn't have to screw any holes in the boat and that holds the rods really secure and then of course we've got the uh, like everybody does the uh, three-quarter inch PVC pipe that the rods go in in the front and uh, got a lot of storage room underneath there I made the decks to where the seats would slide all the way forward and they, they actually slide underneath the deck the the rails do so we can get as far forward as we want and have separation between the front and the back and uh, for the most part I don't even keep the front seat in it I, I fish standing up for the most part in the front but uh, in case my wife's with us uh, you know we'll have two places to sit got a little hummingbird uh, 565 depth finder on it foot control switch uh, LED running lights and that's about it uh, any comments positive or negative I'd appreciate it there's the uh, the panel that we've got on it it's got the Two USB port chargers and a, a 12 volt charger and of course the toggle switches for uh, the electronics running lights and courtesy lights and with one spare that I haven't used yet so uh, anyway let me know what you think thanks a lot